All right, so if you couldn't tell, we survived. We made it back to uh, Los Nevados of Merida. Uh, it's basically where we're staying. And as you can see, it's a beautiful morning. It is cold. I don't have a jacket, reason why. The jackets uh, that I use going up the, the peak, uh, Bolivar, um, are sweaty and they're messy. So when I, when I got back yesterday, I was drenched in mud and sweat and so many things and literally everything I needed, <laughs> It's uh, ready to get washed, but oh man, it, it's it's so nice to be back. It really is. You know, I hadn't taken a shower that whole time. We had nowhere to take a shower. I wasn't gonna jump in the river. My, the way my autoimmune, my autoimmune, my my immune system works. When I get really cold, I have like an autoimmune response, and it, it feels like I'm sick. I'm coughing up phlegm and all this stuff, and I rather just stay warm and sweat the whole time and just grind it out till I get back. But damn, did I stink. <laughs> <laughs> I smell so bad, and I thought it was the other guys, and it was me, but whatever. Um, but it is a really nice town. As you can see, it's a beautiful morning. You know, the where you guys will see the church right there, that is basically the center of town. Uh, for most, for most small towns or villages, the church or the main place where everybody goes to is always going to be the center. Of the of the town of the village is where everybody meets. Um, actually, if you go there, you actually get Wi-Fi. So maybe we'll finally get Wi-Fi. I haven't talked to any of my loved ones for about five days. Actually, no, it's a lie. At the actual peak, when we finally made it to the peak of the mountain, um, where you guys saw the statue, there was there was actually reception there. So <laughs> I was actually able to make some uh, make a vo some audio messages and. I was able to get in contact with some people. But I'll go ahead and show you guys around. Let me show you guys around. So one of these is where I'm staying at. Right in here. Let's go inside. So this is a beautiful place that I'm staying at. So much better than the ground in a sleeping bag. Let's see if there's enough light going into the bathroom. Let's show you guys. Let's see. Man, this is where I'm taking a shower. Very simple setup. There actually is hot water as well. So, there's electricity. We were able to make it back safely. These blankets are made of wool, heavy because we don't have heater at night and it's actually freezing right now, but it's all right, I'll take it. But this is the view that I have and I think it's gorgeous. Oh, this is beautiful. Everybody's waking up. Rise and shine, Carlos. <laughs> He's not waking up. I know I'm freezing too. Oh, Cesar, Cesar. Hey, are you frío, no? No frío, wey. Si. Demasiado. Si, ya se viste. Ah, baby steps. Oh, now I know how, how an old man feels. It takes 10 years to go down the stairs. <laughs> oh, but at least you get a nice view of what the stairs look like. Yep. <clears throat> We're getting there. We're getting there. Oh. Yo! <laughs> todo bien, todo bien. <clears throat> Por lo menos tengo más, bueno. Por lo menos tengo más energía. Porque... Ah, Sí, y, y puedo caminar más rápido. Ya, ya casi. Eh, Buen Toto. Día. ¿Cómo estás? Buenas, buenas. He is our chauffeur. Not chauffeur, he's a driver. The driver of the Range Rover. Buenas, ¿cómo estamos? Yeah. If I didn't show you guys before, I'll show you guys a little more in depth. This is beautiful. Look at this.
That's the lady has been taking care of all of us. She's over there. She's busy. She's always working. This is my favorite part, guys. The view of the mountains. And if you guys ever want to make me happy, this is what you do. You buy me a hammock. <laughs> oh, I love hammocks. It's the best thing ever. So they have four hammocks in total. Where one can lay down and just have a nice, beautiful view to all this. And it looks like the kids on there are about to go into school. They're all waiting to get either to go inside. Yeah, they're all waiting to go inside school. I wish I could lay down in the hammock and keep looking out, but we gotta go. And I'm freezing, so I have to find the sweater fast before I get sick. Hey, pa. <laughs> so Enzio was kind enough to sacrifice himself. Gave me his jacket. It's already one too, so oof. I'm cozy, cozy, cozy. <laughs> She's making arepas, my favorite kind too. Flower arepas. Basically, uh, what is it? Uh, what's it called? Flower cakes? It's called flower cakes. Yeah. Listen, give me music. <laughs> <laughs> Carlos is finally joining us. Yeah, but eventually. You had your sleep? I slept good, but it got really, really cold good. at night. Yeah, I had every blanket on. Yeah, no, same here, man. You look dead. Yeah, yeah you look a little bit. It's just the cold, man. The cold is affecting me more. Yeah. We went through a lot. We went through a lot. Yeah, but in comparison to the way we were feeling when we got back, a lot better. I, know. I, read, I slept today. Like, I yeah, know I slept. Same. At same. least five hours. Yeah, same. I, I, I woke up probably three times, but that's normal. Yeah, I woke up because it was cold and I stayed up like an hour yeah. or two, maybe. But yeah. Yeah, so maybe we should get back uh, and, and uh, hit that guy up and get some haircuts. What else are we going to do today? I'll go with the old man. Okay. I saw an old man cutting. Okay, okay. Woo! Pitas! <laughs> oh my god. That's it. Thank you, thank you. And enjoy it. Thank you very right, much. Alright guys, we're going to get to grubbing. Cesar is here now. Now we can almost eat, we can almost eat now. We're all here. Si, más concentración. Exacto. Y ahí donde se viene mejor. I'm trying to survive here. Fun fact, the, um, the older you are, the better it is for you to mount a climb. Rock climbing. Basically, the reason why is because the concentration level is better. And y otra razón, se te puedes concentrar y cuáles son las otras razones? Y ahora que eso está agotado, yo vi las fotos recién de la pandemia. And because you experience so a lot, of, a lot of great mountain climbers and rock climbers start at 35 years old. Están puteando. Let's just show you. I haven't even started. They're getting everything ready, so we can head back out and go to the city of Media. All right, old men get to enjoy it more. They have more time to see more things. <laughs> There's the first cockadoodle do. I think this is the one that woke me up in the morning. There's the other ones up there. <laughs> bye bye. They're so angry in the morning. I 
Got the front seat this time. <laughs> Carlos and Caesar are in the plaza. See if we get an Airbnb. And well, too bad, so sad. They didn't call C back. <laughs> so I get the front seat. Ciao. These are all the people from the village. Hola. They are starting work. Looks like they're getting ready to I'm, honestly, I don't know. I don't know what they're doing with the propane tanks, but. <clears throat> but, yep, that's work. No, no, no. You ever think about these animals are thinking? He's like, man, I'm bored. Hurry up. Give me something to do. Just standing here doing nothing. Y'all can hurry up just a little. No fast piece. I'm falling asleep right here. <laughs> Don't be so bored. <laughs> We're picking up the guys right here. And right there it says, Welcome to the Nevados. The National Park of Sierra, Sierra Nevada. Haha, <laughs> my last name is on there. Yo! Carlos! I guess we're not picking it up yet. Well, I guess we are. We're gonna wait right here. The guy's coming in. He's got the guys left before we leave. Toto and Encio. Bueno. Y nos vamos. Here we go. Here we go. Listo. Listo, vamos. Una pregunta. ¿Qué fue lo que más te pareció extremo de lo que todas las actividades que hicimos durante el viaje? Lo más extremo. Yo diría el papel de ese. Luz ese. Es ¿verdad? Sí. Tú, Fecho. ¿Cómo utilizar las, las, las manos? ¿verdad? Hola. Hola. O sea, caminando, a veces me sentía medio inútil porque nada más era como que hacia adelante y las piernas hacían el resto, como el equilibrio. Como no te vas a caer. Ya en la piedra, ya, te, ya usaba manos, ya me podía agarrar su
got here we're gonna eat uh, if you guys remember being here we were just here a couple of days ago i think we're gonna eat or drink something i'm not sure oh but i'm starting to definitely decompress breathe better and uh i'm yeah, definitely feeling better you can still see it, i'm tired <laughs> but we're about to uh, get off and drink something Ni pelé, ni pelés. ¡Epa! ¡Nuestro amigo! ¡Epa! ¿Cómo vas? ¿Cómo vas? Bien, señor. ¿Cómo le va? Bien, bien. Pase adelante. Gracias, gracias. ¿Cómo le fue en el paseo? Bien. Mira que ni podemos caminar. Muy bien. Hola, señora. Hola, ¿cómo estás? Bien, bien. Muchas gracias. Bien. So you guys remember this? You guys remember that? We're gonna sit down and relax. Bueno, salud. Salud, salud, salud. Epa, eh. Salud, 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 salud. So this is called chicha, and it's chicha from the Andes. So basically, uh, corn. From up here. Okay. Not sure what it is. All right. All right, guys. Um, I can say I'm Venezuelan, but I never had either chichandina or the other oh chicha. So let's give That's it a go. That's spicy. Oh, we're good. Este de ese lo llaman aquí, ¿cómo lo llama? Lo nombra sangonero, callejonero, y es el que el que fabrican por aquí la gente. Y eso ponen a fermentar la sangre. Sí, sí. Cachicamero también. <laughs> so they're saying if you ferment it long enough, it will easily turn into alcohol and you'll get drunk out of it. Bueno, muchas gracias. Chaito, muchas gracias por todo. Listo, nos vemos la próxima, ¿sí? Espero de que vuelvan y nos vuelvan a, a, vuelva a visitar. Sí, señor, ojalá. Ojalá volvemos. Y esta vez con, con más ánimo. Gracias por todo. Chaito, chaito. Chao, chao, que le vaya muy bien. Chao, chao. Ese es los Andes que se llama aquí, ¿ve? Ese es el Michel Los Andes. El Michel ¿sí? Los Andes que estaba acá. Exacto, porque está. Esto es está... No, y esto, esto es lo que está arriba, es polvo. Y está una vitamina arrechísima, ¿eh? 
Definitely no back in the city, and I can find Pero a green. Bueno, wow, there's a huge aquí, difference yeah. in altitude. Saludos huge difference. Saludos. The air up there is so thin, que, que and I'm from tropical que, weather, right, Miami? Me so me you know the, the air is a lot more humid, and it's just like drinking water. In comparison, there's all the guys here. Everybody's excited. 
Everybody's just calling their moms, calling their girlfriends, their wives, whatever it is. And uh, I'm just calling my mom and saying what's up to you guys. No, no. So on this side. We're trying to find the Airbnb. I don't know if we're a little lost or whatever it is, but I'm just enjoying myself. There's Carlos trying to figure it out. We're getting on the side of the shade. It's hot outside. Hello, See heat, shade. Hello. I'm so tired. I'm exhausted. Finally, <sighs> back in the city, exhausted. And it's a little sad because we just spent four or five days with the guides. They became our really good friends. And we're about to say goodbye to them. But we don't know if we're going to see them again, but we hope so. Everything hurts. My poor nails. My poor nails. Oh. Yeah, yeah, no worries. Yeah, there's no signal up. My voice messages. Same. Same, bro. Same. Ah, no, solamente Carlos y César. Guess what? It wasn't here. The lady is putting, I don't know, I guess she put a different address, I guess for safety, and to see if we're actually gonna stay the night. So we're running around media. No, no, no. no. <laughs> Everybody's trying to help me. See, listen. Everybody's trying to help me because I have no. I mean, not because I have no toes, but because my my nails are about to fall off. We went from sleeping in on the floor in the mountains to this beauty with Wi-Fi. She's showing us around. No, it's just hermoso. Sí, solo que me estoy dando cuenta, ¿no? El edificio más alto. Sí. Alright, guys. So, so now, now need to climb the tallest mountain. We're also in the tallest building in Media. Fancy, fancy. While they go around, get to another apartment, I'm gonna go ahead and relax. But she's about to head out. We're gonna connect to Wi-Fi, catch up with everything we need to do, and I think we're gonna go out to eat. I'll see you when I finish the vlog. Maybe now, maybe in a couple minutes. We had to watch movies. Just trying to figure out the password. <laughs> it's important stuff. Very important. All right, so the guys are really happy right now. Everyone's excited, right, Cesar? Que estás feliz? Cesar? <laughs> there it is. There's that smile. We're all happy that we're back in action. And we actually have a place to actually, well, you can't see my face. We actually have a place to relax. Just enjoy the view because the view is gorgeous. Oof. And we get to actually sleep, eat. We're going to wash our nasty clothes. And we're finally back. I think I'm going to finish the vlog now. I would like to keep vlogging, but I'm positive we're not going to do anything. We're probably just going to pass out, eat, and pass out. That's all we're going to do. I'm positive because we're exhausted. Climbing the tallest mountain in Venezuela is no easy task. And 
I'm losing my nails, and I'm just like, so we're just happy right now. We're just excited, you know, to be to be somewhere where there's, you know, there's comfort. It's cozy. We could breathe. <laughs> and, um, yeah, we're just going to go ahead and enjoy ourselves. Love you guys. Like, subscribe. Any comments, obviously, I would answer them. And uh, I got to let you go. I'm so tired. I'll talk to you guys later.